Congress has until September 30th to keep the federal government running or else a shutdown could take place. So tonight, out of our nation's capital, our Washington, D.C. correspondent Rachel Knapp is joining us live. She's in the U.S. Capitol right now with the latest. Good evening, Rachel. Good evening, Eva. Congressional members are certainly watching the clock carefully on this. They want to make sure that they avoid a government shutdown at all costs. But there are some issues between some members that have some worried that it could lead to one. Now, a few weeks ago, Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer and West Virginia Senator Joe Manchin struck a deal behind closed doors to get the Inflation Reduction Act through. Now, in part of getting that legislation through, Schumer and Manchin agreed to pass legislation which will reportedly streamline the permitting process for energy projects across the U.S. However, this deal is being called a disastrous side deal by Senator Bernie Sanders who has said he intends to oppose the funding resolution as a result of this deal. But Sanders isn't the only one speaking against this deal. There's growing opposition from House Democrats who have also threatened to block the funding bill if it includes that energy permitting deal. And so while there are some uh, fighting between Democrats here, uh, Republicans have also voiced their opposition uh, in this uh, resolution, saying that they are going to also kind of vote against it for the way that Senators Manchin and Schumer went about getting that IRA legislation through. Eva, back to you. All right, that's our Rachel Knapp reporting live from the U.S. Capitol. Rachel, thank you.